Two years ago, we set out on a very audacious journey. We wanted to change the world. We developed a very innovative and bold business plan that would create and accelerate the transition to adoption of electrical vehicles and ultimately would re reduce our dependency on oil. We confronted an industry that really hadn't changed in 100 years. When it came to CO2 emissions and fuel efficiencies, all the improvements were just incremental and marginal. But we needed a drastic change. We wanted a revolution, not an evolution. We expected monumental challenges and set out on an evangelistic mission. Yet today, after two exhilarating years, we can see significant movements. Consumer research data shows us that the consumers are preferring electric vehicles as their alternative vis-a-vis -vis hydrogen or biofuels. The automakers are beginning to mass produce electric vehicles as they too understand that that's the preferred alternative by the consumers. Utilities are figuring out how do they support the adoption of electric vehicles. And entrepreneurs all over the world are beginning to think about different business models and offerings to support this and how we can create other renewable energies and bring them up to speed to power the electric vehicles. So there is tremendous momentum on the path towards electrification. But our job is far from being done. And execution and delivery is still ahead of us. We need to integrate with the utilities and the electric power grid. We need to deploy our, and roll out our infrastructure in different regions around the world. We need to provide our consumers with an unparalleled driving experience. And we need to turn renewable energies into a reality. I'm personally thrilled about our steady progress towards electrification. It may look evolutionary, but it is incredibly revolutionary.